The Wizard of Us, forward by Deepak Chopra and written by me, Jean Houston. It's subtitled Transformational Lessons from Oz. You know, I was born to write this book because it's a story that really tells us about who we are, where we are, and what we can do in our time. My life, my work is about transformation, human transformation as well as social change. And this book is about that. Look at its major themes. It begins in yearning, the call, oh, if only somewhere over the rainbow is my true life. I'm living in an outmoded situation. This is poor Dorothy there in the center of um, the bleak Kansas. And it takes a tornado. It takes a violent change in climate to really carry her over into the deep world, the world of her creative unconscious, the world of all possibilities. And that's so true of us too, isn't it? What does it take to get you, to take you to the place of the higher journey of the deeper life? And then of course, who does she meet there? She meets, well, the great higher guidance, the archetype of her higher self, Glinda, who leads her onto the road of spiritual pollen, the, the yellow brick road. Who is our, who or what is our higher guidance? How can we really learn to tap into this guidance and be carried to the next part of our journey? She meets the disheartened and disenfranchised parts of herself, the scarecrow, who thinks he has no brain but actually has perhaps the greatest intelligence of all. And one of the things we try to show you in this book is the great capacity you have for new ways of thinking, being, knowing. And then too, of course, she meets the Tin Man, the heart, the heartful one who has been disempowered in his heart. How do we enter into this time of heartfulness, of radical empathy? She meets the cowardly lion, and who discovers, as we discover too, that we have vast reserves of courage to do what we have to do. And then the great journey itself that takes us finally to the Emerald City. Oh, I love that Emerald City because what is it? It's, it's, a, it's a place of our own yearning for the possible society that is there for us all. And how do we help create this possible society? And the wizard, but we discover, as the wizard himself says, that he's really not much of a wizard, but he's a very good man. And we discovered that the wizard is us. We contain the magic of new possibilities that we can bring into time, that we can use to transform our lives and our societies. So please, Join me in the reading of this book. I had such fun reading it, The Wizard of Us.